Hi everybody, my name is Rich, and uh, I just want to welcome you to our video here. Basically, I'm a golfer. My daughter Ella is a golfer. She's in eighth grade, uh, going to be playing some high school golf uh, starting up next summer. And she's been playing golf for about two years. Uh, I'm just looking to, uh, you know, get better. I've, we've got a SkyTrack system here. We're, we live up in Wisconsin, so we got these long winters. And uh, our goal is just to get better at golf. And one of the ways to do that is by trying to increase our swing speed. And I've tried a lot of different things, uh, really took golf seriously for the past three years. Uh, got my swing down halfway decent, and, uh, but now I'm trying to add a little bit of extra speed. And so we are going to go through the training using Super Speed Golf. And uh, for those of you not familiar, this is the over speed training system. We have a light, uh, medium, and a heavy swing. And uh, basically you swing these things as hard as you can. Uh, you swing them right-handed, you swing them left-handed, you swing them with a step uh, both ways. And then uh, later on in the protocols, you actually uh, do it kneeling. And you do this three times a week. And uh, the, the goal is through overspeed training to be able to increase your uh, all your clubs. I'm specifically looking at driver, obviously, that's gonna be the easiest monitor. That's the one that people are mo most familiar with when you talk about swing speeds. And so uh, I'm, I'm roughly at about 100, and uh, Ella's at about 56. And so we're just gonna kinda see how this goes. Uh, it's November here in Wisconsin. We got a long winter, so we're gonna see how fast we can get our swings. We're gonna do it by the book. We're gonna chronicle it, so I'll show you guys a couple swings from me and from Ella, and uh, some data on the SkyTrack here. And then we're, we're gonna do a new video updating our speeds once a week, so you guys can see kind of how we progress. The initial protocol has us doing, oh, and by the way, for Ella, because she's, she's small, I've got a lead weight shaft here, and then she'll use that one along with the, the two lighter weight ones and then I'll use the normal three. And we'll just see how that goes. If it looks like this is working, uh, but it could be a little better, maybe I think they got a junior set that I would get for her. And we'll just see how it goes. But uh, I'm pretty excited about it. I know that the reviews of this has been great. Uh, I know on Golf WRX, uh, some guys are just having some amazing results from this, seeing up to 15% swing speed improvement. If I could hit 115 miles an hour, that would just be fantastic. So we're gonna follow the protocols exactly, and uh, we'll just post progress as we go. So here's a couple swings from uh, Ella and I and the ball data. And, uh, and then, yeah, hopefully you guys tune in each week to see our progress. So thanks for watching. Okay, so as you can see, I had a 99 mile per hour average over five shots, and I had 145 mile an hour ball speed average. And also you can tell that the swing speed radar uh, was reading about nine miles per hour faster than the SkyTrack, uh, 110 to 101. And I believe that the SkyTrack is more accurate in this case. Okay, and these are Ella's numbers, and you can see uh, she's got a 55 mile an hour club head speed with her driver, uh, averaged over five shots, and an 81 mile an hour ball speed. And these are our baselines, and now we're going to start the super speed training.
so we finished up with the uh, the super speed uh, training protocol um, so basically the way that this works is there's the three shafts like I mentioned before we have the light the medium and heavy and we're in the introductory protocol uh, which means that we swing uh, the light shaft three times regular then three swings medium three swings heavy then we swing left-handed three swings light medium heavy then we do step swings where we put our feet together and then step into it as you could you saw it uh, with ella there earlier and we do uh three swings light medium heavy and then we do left-handed step swings three swings light medium heavy and then at the end we finish up with three swings with the light shaft uh and then that's it and it was interesting uh the left-handed swings were quite interesting how did you like the left swing left-handed swings they were very different yeah it's just something that we were getting used to i could actually feel myself kind of getting more a little bit more coordinated towards the end what was interesting about ella is i could actually hear the the swooshes that she was making getting louder as she did it especially with the step swings and it was really interesting that when we were all done with this ella got on and she hit a 63 mile an hour club head speed drive, which I believe is the fastest I've ever seen a record. So I definitely think that there's something to this system, um, you know, and the reviews have been so positive on it. So we have four weeks of the introductory protocol, and then we're going to get into uh, protocol number one, which is going to add in uh, kneeling swings, which I think is going to help with your arm speed. So that'll be pretty interesting. You excited for the, for the kneeling swings? Yeah, I'm a little interested to see how it works. Yeah. Yeah, it'll definitely be different. Uh, we'll have to come up with something to, so our knees don't get too sore there uh, at the shop, but we'll figure something out. So anyways, we're going we're gonna to do this uh, Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. And Saturday, we're going to come in. We're going to warm up just like we did. And then we're going to do five driver swings, and we're going to post the results uh, next week so you can kind of see our progress. And this is going to go on through April. So it'll be interesting to see if this works. If any of you guys are considering the super speed golf uh you know system i hope you find uh this uh, information valuable so i hope you have a great day thanks for watching